Hey everybody, this is Ken from I Can Be. Just gonna go over a little bit of a homemade recipe for how you can make your own winter patties for your bees. Pretty simple. I don't want you to be too complicated over this because it's very easy and you can do it at home and save yourself a lot of money. You'll see these bee patties being sold online and they're expensive, but you can do it. A couple of ingredients that you're gonna need, I'm gonna go over with you. All right, you're gonna get your hands dirty now. Here we go. First, just need sugar. This one here is a four pound bag of sugar. I prefer Honey Bee Healthy. You need a mixing pot and a tray. So I'm gonna take some parchment paper. I'm gonna cover the tray first with the parchment paper. That's gonna go here. I'm gonna dump four pounds of sugar into my bowl. I've measured this. This is one of my favorite beer glasses. I've measured this. This is just about seven and a half ounces of water. You can do a little bit less or a little bit more. It doesn't really matter because the water is basically going to just mix it up like concrete. And then when you put it in the oven to dry out, it's going to make it solid. So it doesn't matter if you're a little too much or a little too less. I'd rather have that you're a little too less than too much, that's the best. All right, so seven and a half ounces, four pounds of sugar, a splash of honey be healthy. You see what I'm saying when I say a splash? This isn't science, folks, they're bees. They've been around for millions of years. They don't get to choose what they get or they don't get. They've been fighting forever to live, so a little extra, a little more, a little less, a little slightly less, whatever you wanna do, it's gonna be fine. All right, so here we go. First, we're gonna open up this container. I have a little bit left over in there from one of the other patties that I made, which is fine. Dump in your sugar. It's that easy. Next, a little bit of water. Pour the water in, right over the sugar. Honey be healthy. When I say a splash, the stuff is strong. So just a little splash. That's it, okay? It's basically like a tablespoon to two tablespoons in that area. Now, you're just gonna mix this all together. I'm gonna put my phone down over here so you guys can see I'm mixing. All right, and we're gonna stir this up really good. Get your hands dirty, get in there if you have to. I like to use just a regular spoon just to mix it up. I'm just gonna stir that honey bee healthy and that water together. So you're gonna make like a sugar paste, that's it. Pretty simple, right? Now think about it. Just in a few minutes, you're gonna save yourself hundreds of dollars compared to what you're paying to buy these patties online. All right. That's good right there. Just gonna give you a quick view of what that looks like. That's it. It's just stirred together. This is not science. It's just a concoction. Mixing it together, it's gonna to be fine. Now I'm gonna put the parchment paper down. Hold on a second. You can use wax paper, you can use parchment paper, whatever you'd like. You basically just want something that's safe for the bees. Some people use newspaper, that's it. All right, here we go. Now we're just gonna take this, we're just gonna pour it in. That's it. Hey, here it comes. I'm gonna help this along with the spoon. Put you down over 
here. Just give this a little scoop. Get it out of there a little quicker. Now, here's the next step. Parchment paper is in your tray, right? The tray looks like that. Parchment paper, just squish it down. It's just like about maybe a half of an inch to an inch thick. That's it. Work it into the corners. It'll level itself out after a little bit. All right, now here's the part that's important. Just wash off my hands real quick. Get everything all sticky so my wife doesn't get upset. I've already got some in the oven. Notice the oven light is on. I'm gonna put this in the oven. I'm just gonna leave the light on overnight. I'm not actually even gonna turn the oven on. Just the light bulb is gonna be enough heat to dehydrate all of these trays. If you want to go a little faster, you can put the oven on very low temperature for a very short period of time. You do not want this to get too hot. You do not want this to burn. The bees won't like it. Just naturally let it dry out overnight. Tomorrow, cut it up into your squares, put it right in the hives. It doesn't matter if the parchment paper is stuck to the back of it, the bees will get rid of it, they don't care. This is an easy way for you to be able to feed your bees over the winter so you don't have to worry about them. Get out there, get your sugar in, it's getting cold. All right, that's it from I Can Bee. Take care.